Well, would you look at that, yo? Hey, everybody, my name's Silver, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play here on the channel. Welcome to Saint Seiya Soldier Soul, Saint Seiya Knights of the Zodiac Soldier Soul. Before we do begin, though, with this Let's Play, I gotta address a couple things. For this Let's Play, I'm not going to be using the green screen, even though I still do have it up for me. If I can find a way to actually edit and actually, like, make, like, the green screen actually like, come out nice and decent other than, like, booty and trash, then yes, we'll use it, but... For right now, if that, that's probably not going to happen. So if you see me in like a white little circle, then that's that. Other than that, though, it's either like a white circle or like a black box. I'm not really sure. But either way, though, welcome to Saint Sayer Soldier Soul. I just want to let you guys know uh, Bandai was having a PlayStation 4 sale for a shit ton of anime games. And this game was $15. All of the DLC is free. I love Saint Seiya. I actually started to watch it, but... All I know for me personally, while I'm watching it, I'm on like the second arc, but apparently Soldier Soul covers the entire Saint Seiya from the very first arc to the very end, not counting the other series though. Also, something I something else I guess I should address as well is that um, this is blind. But before we do begin with any and all of that, if you guys are hyped for the very beginning of our new Let's Play of Saint Seiya Soldier Soul, make sure to hit that like button for your boy as well as consider subscribing to the channel for more anime game related content. Without further ado, let's begin. Oh my goodness, so we are now at the main menu, so we have the Legend of the Cosmos, experience the Saint Seiya story from another perspective. You can have the regular battles, uh, the online battles, the options, and the collections, and the assist phrase. Huh. The Battle of Gold, whoa! <laughs> Yo! Huh. So at least for now, we're gonna go through the entire Legend of Cosmos. If you guys want me to, after we're done, we can take on the Battle of Gold. And I don't know if people still do like online matches over this. I kind of I kind of really want to play this game. I do love Saint Say as a character. He oh my goodness, he is technically my new MC, you know, you know, man. But that's just you know how much I'm actually uh here for the Saint Say series, or at least the character, you know, since I'm not really done yet. This actually does not look bad. I do know that this game actually came out like 20. 15 maybe 17 i think it was 17 uh oh otozureshi shounen tachi o kimi tachi ni atena o takusu okay huh all right well i guess another thing i should say though is because of the fact that you know the new anime game jump force just came out you know a lot of people love jump force well at least like the battles and like their favorite characters and you know, everybody wants their favorite character to get into the jump force but i do remember when the open beta had first came out and we saw the roster and nobody knew who saint seiya was i'm not gonna lie to you guys i didn't know who saint seiya was so i asked around hey yo who is saint seiya who like you know like what is this series Series. like who is Pegasus Seiya and with that you know I came to watching the series and now we're here on playing the game but either way though as you guys can probably tell we do have four chapters to go through either the chapter of Sanctuary the chapters Asgard, the chapter of Poseidon and then the chapter of Hades I just want to let you guys know that we are going to be going through those in that order so first we are going to go through the chapter of Sanctuary and I do see this tutorial right here I kind of want to start this because again this is blind so I kind of want to learn how to play. And since they do have a tutorial button, wait a second. Okay. So we have the move, the ground attack, guard throw, air attack, burst dash, burst attack, cosmo charge, special move, light speed move, seven synth, big bang attack, battle tips, final exam. I guess we might as well just start from the very beginning. To move, uh, move in the direction indicated by the left stick, press the X button on the jump, press the L1 button and the X button on the face, and move quickly towards the opponent. So we have our regular moving, okay, I like that. You have your X button to jump, okay. My man can jump really high, what the hell? And then we have the step. Well, that's clean! It looks like I am warmed up now. Hold the phone, ground attack. <laughs> the knowledge of a saint, shout out to the trophies, big fella. Okay. 
show you what your weapon can do to attack you can press the square button for the regular attack triangle for the strong attacks for combos press the square and the triangle in the succession to create combos each character has their own combo specific combo strings press the options button to open up the combo list really wait a second so we have a combo list so huh okay <laughs> i like that i like that oh wait a second okay regular attack i like that what a strong attack boom okay i like that and then we gotta mash it yo that's a combo Ooh. okay i kind of like this i like this Oh my goodness! This is a 3D fight, man. Guard, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm starting to love this game. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I didn't think this game would look this freaking good. I mean, you know, she is kind of true there, at least for that one. Okay, guard with the L1 button. You can defend attacks. Oh, you can defend against all attacks except the throws. Guard breaking. Taking continuous attacks while guarding will change the guard effect from blue to red. If you take any more attacks while the guard effect is red, it will cause a guard breaking below you, or, or at least blow through your guard, so you won't be able to guard after a guard break. Okay. Break fall. If you've been sent flying by any attack, press the X button immediately before hitting the ground. Yes, my battery is low. Yes, I know that. Okay. Shout out to the block. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I am saying? Say, you know what I Pegasus just say it. You know, I get to guard everything. <laughs> okay. Attack repeatedly and break her guard. Okay. What the? Okay. There we go. Broke the guard. Look at that. So, at least they don't let you go through, like, a set combo, you know, and then oh shit, you know, like you use a broker guard. But I like this. After being launched, press the X button. Uh, okay, there we go. I'm not gonna lie to you, I spam that X button. <laughs> I was trying to make sure I, I was trying to make sure I did that little backflip, you know, that I was be able to be okay. Huh. Okay, so now we're gonna go on the throws. I guess we might as well just make this episode the tutorial episode. It depends at least like how long it is, but real quick though, I guess I could say hold the phone though. Well, actually, I can go and uh, mention this right now since you know we do have like this little time and space to breathe. Saint Seiya, if you have not known about it, is all about gods. <laughs> as you can tell right now, we are. Pegasus say, but we don't have the Pegasus cloth on us right now. So right now our name is Jaseya. The person who we are with right now, shout out to Marin, or whatever her name is. I freaking forgot. But either way, though, she's like our teacher. She's the one teaching us about everything. I I know that they'll go deeper into the story when we actually do click the chapter of Sanctuary, then go through all of that, you know. But at least for now, you you just know that right now we're in Greece training. So either way, though, the throw button, press the L1 and the uh, square button or the L1 and triangle to close on the opponents to perform a throw. Really? Oh, so that's his rolling crush. Okay, so what's this? Hey, whoa, I wanted to check out the other one. That is true. That makes sense as well. Really? Wait, wait a second, wait a second. Oh, so I just did the one with the triangle. It turns out it was the exact same move. So I guess there you go. I at least wanted to check it out first. All right, I guess we're gonna move on to air attacks now. And while she does talk, I can at least say 
that if I am kind of moving like a little bit faster than she is actually talking, you know, it's because I can barely hear. My computer screen is now right here other than using, you know, like the TV, which would be all the way over there. Like it's not really that high just so like you guys won't be able to, you know, hear like the background noise. So, you know, you're welcome. <laughs> but either way, though, mid-air attacks, you can perform regular and strong attacks while jumping. These actions differ from those on the ground, so feel free to experiment. Okay. Oh, so I literally just have to, okay. I was about to say, I kind of just wanted to wait for the fall, you know. The burst dash can be used to follow up on mid-air attacks. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I'm not mad. This really is like a 3D fighter, though. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. And you know, I am very used to 3D fighters, so this is definitely, this is definitely not bad. Plus, the game just looks beautiful as well. I, I, I like this. I like this. But either way, though, burst dash. Push your left stick while holding in the L2 button in X to perform a light speed burst dash forwards or backwards. Burst dashes require Cosmo Gauge to use. So, anyways, I'm going to try and get some space because I am kind of curious, you know, how far I can go with this. But, oh. I like that. Move the L stick or to move away. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. I mean, just a little bit, but... Okay. And we got burst attack. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. That burst dash, either going forward or backwards... I, I, I don't wanna, like, jinx myself while we get to, like, later fights. And, you know, we actually see, like, enemies or CPUs or people online, if people still play this game online, you know, using it. Then it kind of really does seem, like, real easy to, I guess you could say, like, read, you know? But I do want to read this burst attack. You can do a regular burst attack with the L2 and the square button. You can do a strong burst attack with the triangle button. Burst attacks require Cosmo Gauge to use. Doing burst attacks won't... Well, doing burst attacks, you won't be knocked back by enemy attacks. They're useful for stopping enemy moves. Okay. So that's a burst attack for the triangle button. I do want to check out... Uh, I mean, for the square button. My bad. My B. Alright. We have Cosmo Charge. The fighting style of the Saint truly comes from its own core, the Cosmos. That is fact. Okay. Shoddy is real bad, though. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. But the Cosmo Gauge, a gauge that feels as you battle. Certain attacks and actions consume your Cosmo Gauge. The Cosmo Charge just to hold it down. Okay. Oh, I like that. He's doing the Pegasus thing. I like that, bro. I like that. So I'm guessing every character has their own different Cosmo Charge. Okay. What's next? A special move. Finally, we get to go into special moves now. What's popping with you, Queen? You gotta let me know. Press the circle button to fire a phantom. Oh, a photon. I'm so sorry. What the heck? Wow, well, weak. They only use small amounts of the Cosmo Gauge, so you can use them to keep your opponents in check. Okay. Their strength abilities differ from each character. Your special move, though, will fire your fist or your first special move with the R2 square button. Say it uses the Pegasus Meteor Fist. Pegasus Rui Say Gang, you know what I'm saying? To release countless punches. The special move requires Cosmos to use. The amount of Cosmo Gauge consumes different for each character to move. The special move 2, however, which is the R2 in the square button, or my bad, the triangle button, is this Pegasus Comet Fist. Huh. Okay, so I want to fire this. Ooh, I like that. I like that little photon punch, you know what I'm saying? I thought it said Phantom for its that, because, I mean, you know, like, it, it probably would be better as, like, a Phantom Punch, not a Photon Punch, but... I, I'm, I'm just going to go, I'm just going to go with what they tell me, all right? Oh, what the? That was... Press the... Oh, the R2 button. My B. Okay. The Meteor Fist just won't be enough. You damn right it won't. Let me show her what we can do. Press that button to fire the Pegasus Comet Fist. Okay. Oh, I can see it right there. So we have the Pegasus Meteor Fist, the Comet Fist, and the Pegasus Meteor Fist as the BBA, which I'm probably sure is the Big Bang Attack. But either way, though, I do want to check out this Comet Fist. Okay. Okay. 
yeah, <laughs> not that different. I am a fan of the Pegasus Media Fist, you know what I'm saying? I love that shit. It is absolutely beautiful. I guess we're going to light speed move though. It was with this music. Okay. Yeah. This music is fire. Eagle Toe Flash, what type of? Pressing the R1 button, the instant enemy attack hits you, lets you perform a light speed move dodging the attack. Really? Oh, but it does require Cosmos to use. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Ah! Ooh! -hoo 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 -hoo. I like that, bruh. I do. Uh, I like that. That is nice. My goodness. Okay, the seventh sense. I'm, I'm, I mean, we getting there. We're almost done. I really am glad that we went through this tutorial, though. My goodness, man. I just did not want to hop in this bitch blind. I mean, if you say so, the Seven Sense Awakening, you press the R3 button with a full Seven Sense gauge will cause the Seven Sense Awakening. Awakening offers powerful effects such as enchanted attacks and easier guard breaks. Okay. I like that. Huh. So if you guys didn't know in the Saint Seiya universe, the seven senses is supposed to be the ultimate com it's supposed to be the ultimate cosmos. In other words, we have our regular five senses. Some people have the sixth sense, and then if you can achieve past that, that's where the seven sets comes in. Hopefully when we go through the story, they'll go farther in depth with that. But I want to try this big bang thing. Cause this is even new to me. Big bang attacks, press the R2 button and the circle button when your 7 sense gauge is full or while awakened will unleash an ultra powerful special move, the big bang attack. Each character has their own big bang attack. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. That did a good like 30% of HP as well? Huh. Battle tips. Final exam. I kind of want to go through these battle tips then. You know, since... I mean, like, you know, like, we might as well. In conclusion, when battle starts, calmly observe your opponent's movements. Button matching will make for an easy victory. Sometimes you must distance yourself from the enemy attack. Or the enemy and attack. What's more, the same attack pattern won't work forever. Change your attack patterns to suit your opponent. That's crazy. That's actually crazy then. Because that means that you can't just go in there, do your regular, regular combo, and be set. But that makes sense. Hold the phone. I want to go through this final exam. Let's go. I bet you the final exam is just going to be to beat her, huh? Well, there we go. Defeat Marin. Oh, I'm sick. Oh, I'm sick. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I gotta get used to this shit, big fella. Whoa. <laughs> Let's buzz. You know what I'm talking about, Chief. I don't guard that. Okay. Ugh. Oh, you can really hit it with the combos in this bitch. Oh, the floatiness is really gonna be a uh, a problem, big fella. I know that much. I wanna try this though. Oh, wait a second, I hit the wrong thing. Let me charge my, uh, my gauge a little bit. Skirt, oh no, I, I'm playing like I'm in Jump Force. Hold the phone. Get up. Wait a second. Ooh. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. No, she blocked it off. Hello? Did she just go in her seventh? Bitch, do you know who I am? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come here. 
I kind of want to hit it with the uh, the Pegasus Meteor Fist. Y'all know what I'm saying? Ooh, it hit too? Oh, yeah. This is beautiful. Can you imagine that? That was a tutorial and I had that much trouble. My goodness. <laughs> Yo, what? Oh, man. This game's gonna be fun, fun. This game's gonna be fun, fun. Pegasus say the training outfit is now available as a playable character. The Eagle Marin, which again is the teacher, shout out to that. Her training gear is now available. The Pegasus say the training outfit is now a uh, character model is now available for purchase in the Eagle, in the Eagle Marin, the training gear. You got the title one, my name is. You got title two, Saint. Okay. That was not bad at all. Well, I'm going to keep this first episode really short. I'm actually going to go ahead and end off this episode right here. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did enjoy, do not forget to hit that like button for your boys. Well, as consider subscribing to the channel for more anime game related content. Again, because this is the first episode, let's see if we can actually do something that I don't really do at all. And that's just like goals. Let's see if we can get up to, I want to say a clean 15, 15 likes. If we can get up to 10, 15 likes, y'all, that will be very good to me. It'll definitely help out the channel a lot over here. But either way, though, let me know what you guys think, at least about the gameplay. Since I know that we haven't done any story, the next episode, we'll, we will actually start the chapter Sanctuary. But let me know what you guys think about the gameplay, if you like, how the characters are, how the combat is, if you guys are actually interested in this Let's Play or not. But either way, though, I'm a dip. Have a good day. Have a good night, wherever you are. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!